It's a very sad day for me. It's a very, very, very sad day for me. And you kind of begin to move on until those things are put into your face. Guess who I'm interviewing? I'm coming to speak to now. Yes, I'm speaking to my friends from Keta Senior High Technical School who kicked Wesley Girls out of the NSMQ. But it's okay, for God and country, we shall do this. Um, but congratulations to you guys. Um, you did so well, so, so well. Um, and we're so proud. There are quite a few multimedia journalists who came to MKT as they're making a lot of noise, yeah. doing two known all over the place. Um, so well done to you guys. Um, how are we speaking to you soon? But I just want, mm -hmm. to, want to speak to the kids first. How did it feel to come from being unrecognized? Nobody would have put their money on you guys from the beginning. I mean, you know that, right? Yeah, like to being the school that had everybody who didn't go to Prosec and didn't go to Prempe was rooting for you guys. How, how did that feel? Bright, tell me a little. Okay. It was very exciting to make it to the finals for the very first time in the history of our school as well, and also the Volta region. Mm. So we were very much excited. Okay, so when you were going in, did you think that, I mean, I know you, you were probably told, okay, you can do it, you can do it, but did you really think in your heart that, okay, we will beat all these schools and get to the finals? Go ahead, please. Now that we in the competition for the trophy, we will go into the finals and then we take the trophy home. But unfortunately, we couldn't take the trophy. No, I, I don't even think it was unfortunate because you guys did so brilliantly. Um, and, and you know that everybody loves you. Like, you guys are just, are just something else um, to have done what, what you did. Um, so let, let me speak, let me speak mm. to you um, now. What, what did it take to get um, your, your students? Yeah. First of all, even just the confidence, you know, to yeah. say build up that kind of confidence in them. Yeah. So good morning to your viewers. Um, it's such a great honor for us to be here on the show uh, for Keta Secondary School. Well, it took a lot of effort for the school in preparing towards this competition. Um, there's actually an NSMQ governing board in the school okay. that is chaired by some old students okay. who are actually being participants. Uh, for the contest before. Okay. So we have the likes of uh, Dr. Benjamin Boafo, uh, Dr. Emmanuel Aguematu at the police hospital, uh, who have actually spent some time. So this is something we have been doing behind the scenes uh, in preparing, because you notice that year in, year out, we come out close to getting to the, se uh, to mm. the, uh, to the finals, then we are knocked down at the semifinal. Mm. So last year, a similar thing happened, and we're poised, we are determined that this year, we're gonna go far than just coming to the semi. So, uh, we went to back to the drawing board uh, quickly after the last uh, competition and started working and mapping uh, strategies towards that. So it's not surprising that we've come this far, and by far being the first school in the Volta region, having come to the, the final stages of the NSMQ. And also for the fact that uh, due to inclusion and diversity, the shine one way or the other seems to be coming to Kitasco. Yeah. No, it pains me when yeah. you add, unfortunately, because, <laughs> no, I say that because it definitely took you more yeah. than it did Presec, who yeah. have done this, yes. you know, or even Prempe, who have won this. Yeah. It definitely took you more. Yeah. So please don't put unfortunately before <laughs> it. It's an amazing thing, yeah. you know, that you guys have done. Yeah. And I mean, you talk about Francisca, and, and obviously, I mean, she is being celebrated, um, and we, we appreciate that it's teamwork. Um, she would usually do two rounds, I think, and then you would substitute her. Yeah, you were playing the to trust, the strengths, yeah. exactly, you yeah. know, and, and it was teamwork, and your boys were brilliant. Mm -hmm. But women in Ghana are so excited. Oh, yeah. People who are nude, people who are messing about, mm -hmm. people who are... She so she just see a girl doing science and math and being confident yes. and speaking up. It's something that, you know, we're all excited about. Absolutely. And I hope that in our celebration of that, mm -hmm. it doesn't dim the, the teamwork yeah. that went into it yeah. and the amazing work that the boys have done sure. um, as well. Yeah. But Francisca, so let me ask you how it feels um, for you 
in the first place you're dealing with boys like <laughs> that's even stress on its own like my team they're all boys they're very very stressful um but how how did it feel for you being up there and hearing this crowd of boys making noise and making noise and making noise like how did it feel for you from the uh, our coordinators mr isaac boatin mr kuku achecho our old students took us through we were able to learn how to manage pressure from the crowd mm. so then by that we, we, we okay. got used to it okay so then we didn't get scared of any school or and all the, the, the pressure that came mm. what was it like being in a team with um, full of boys because the girls schools will have different issues all girls but this was you and the boys so what, what was that like it's very nice the Kita School and SMQ actually we are a member of 12 okay 12 members, 12 members. yes and we are two girls okay and the rest are boys but due to the unity in the team the hard work from our colleagues is just so nice we get to learn a lot from them they are very loving. They give out their best. Hey, you people are loving. <laughs> you people don't look like loving, but are you sure they are loving? Yes, I, I see. see. Okay. And yeah. the rest at home, our team leader, Sir Francis, um, Oklu Elom, um, Tesla, that's the Gwanda, and a lot whose name I can't mention. Can't mention of course. We really appreciate them. And we are so much thankful to them for their hard work. They really did well. Okay, so um, what, what are some of the, the things? What, what year are you guys in? You're in, are you in, are you in SHS 3? Yes, mm -hmm. So this is, it, this is it for you. It's not like you're coming back next year. Mm -hmm. what, are your, what are your dreams? What, what do you want to do now? Now that you've, you've done this, what's next for you? Let me start with you, right? I'm going to pursue electrical. I'm not your girlfriend, though. Stop whispering. <laughs> ah, is this how you've been whispering to your girlfriend? Aha, uh -huh, so let me hear you properly. I'm planning on reading electrical engineering. You want to do electrical engineering? Yes. And then I've applied to the local universities in Ghana. Mm -hmm. As the uh, Kwame Kuma University of Science and Technology. As well as University of Ghana and Ligon. Okay. Please, our investors, if you are listening, please, we've applied to you. So uh, we are coming there on full scholarship too, please. Um, what about you? Yeah. I also like to read medicine. Okay. And then also, I've also applied to the local universities. Okay. Kamika University of Science and Technology. Technology. Yeah. And then Lego. Yeah. Okay, to do medicine. Okay, what about you? Okay, I would also like to read medicine. Okay. And I applied to University of Ghana, Lego. And University of Health and Allied Sciences. Sciences. Okay. All right. Well, the universities are listening, so they've applied to you. Um, I think that it should. Do, please don't make it too difficult for them, and we would appreciate that. Yeah. So, what are some of the lessons learned um, from the NSMQ generally, and um, for the team, and what to expect next year? And what do you need? Yeah. How do we help you? Mm. Augusto has a whole block science lab. Um, yeah. for science lab. Presec yeah. has this. Prempe has that. What does Ketasco mean? I, I, I think we should hear from the horses to Omar. So, Francisca. <laughs> <laughs> okay. What do you guys need? Yeah. Okay. Actually, we do not have a science center of excellence. That's the NSMQ team. We just have some classroom okay. where we do our studies and practice. So, we'll be very glad if we get a science center of excellence which will be well equipped with all that the students, that's our genius, we need to participate. Mm. For instance, we need some laptops and then tablets so that they can study with them. They can them. study with. Yeah. A generator would be nice so that if the lights go off, um, more textbooks, some Wi-Fi, internet yeah. maybe, yeah. so that you can access everything that so, you so need. So we are looking for the old students, we are looking at having an ultra-modern science um, center of excellence as Francisca said, and this center would actually have uh, accommodation uh, uh, facilities as well, as well as uh, the lavatories as well, so that when they come in there study, and they can rest, they can they rest. Can bath, yeah, they can you, you, you'd find out that while they study in the classroom, when it's time to rest, they go to that huge dormitory to, uh, to sleep alone, whilst their colleagues are on vacation. So when we have this center, 
um, mainly fitted with all these facilities, it will be easier. And then you also notice that another uh, logistical uh, constraint we have as a school is uh, the facility to move them, the vehicle to move them doing the regional tours, doing the inter-school competitions. Okay. So we need a bus too. We need a bus as well. Okay. Then for a school as well, when we have, when we rather host other schools for competitions like this, where to have that facility becomes a challenge. Okay. So we are uh, looking forward uh, to the, uh, the general public, corporate Ghana, benevolent people to come to our aid. We need an ultra-modern uh, uh, um, assembly hall that can accommodate many of these activities that we yeah. undertake in okay. the school. And with all these things in place, we should be able to uh, bring the travel to the Volta region and, S and SMQ. Yeah. Okay, um, so if you heard it from Francisca first, the things that um, you guys need. Um, is there anything else that you think we've left out, you guys? No? How about your dreams to pursue uh, your studies abroad, if given an opportunity? Mm. Are you looking at schools abroad? Mm -hmm. You are? Yes. So what are those schools? <laughs> Let's hear them. <laughs> MIT. Mm -hmm. MIT. Mm -hmm. Use. Where? Use. Okay. Yeah. And where else? <laughs> I also like to go to Yale University. You like to go to Yale? Mm. I see. Yeah, so I hear them talking about all the schools whilst coming in the, in the car. So it's just important that they put it out there so that um, those with the necessary support, those who can give them funding, can, can come to our can aid. Come to yeah. our aid. Yeah. I mean, if there was any time that you wanted to use your money um, for something, and you weren't sure what to do. I don't know how many Ghanaians are not sure what to do with their money, but there are lots of people out there who can, and we would love it if you could help um, Keta. We need a science center, we need a bus, we need some laptops and tablets an and hall. an assembly hall. We really just need to equip them um, so that they can continue to shine. Now, James, right? Yeah. You are the super sub um, for the, the NSMQ. How, how did it feel for you in that moment when you looked up and you saw Presec and Prempe and you were like, okay, yes, this, this is, how did you feel in that moment going up against those two schools? Yeah. That's what I actually like. Like, I really like seeing a crowd. And, and so you really like, I can't hear you. I really like seeing a like, crowd, the crowd mm. shouting. So going onto that stage, I was very happy going to it. Like seeing, just seeing a car. You enjoyed it, eh? Yeah, I mean, you enjoyed, yeah. yeah, you enjoyed firing. Yeah. Okay, what's what about you, right? Same thing. You also enjoyed firing. How, how were you able to, you, 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 you are the one who did that. So you were answering questions that they hadn't finished asking. And then the quiz which just goes like, how? How did you answer the question? Tell us. Okay, so like, uh -huh. for, that, for, for that particular question, like, all the relevant things that were needed for the question to be solved had, had already been given. Been given. Uh -huh. So like that, that was why I rang the and then gave the answer. I see. So even though she hadn't asked the question, you knew that based on the information that had been given. Exactly. It was, that was amazing. Definitely one of the highlights of the NSMQ yeah. um, to hear you answer the question like that. I, I, I'm going to give you the chance to give out the yeah. details. But before that, um, I, I pray that all your dreams come true because you guys are amazing and you deserve the best. And Francisca, um, there's so many little girls who are watching, you know, um, a lot of them had their hopes in Gehe that, you know, we would go to the finals, <laughs> but we didn't and it's all good. Yeah. Um, but you did, you were there. And, f and for us, you know, it was nice to see a woman up there. So I just want you to talk to all the little girls who, you know, are dreaming of one day going to the NSMQ and, and you know, really just tell them that, you know, you don't actually have to be a sleigh queen. You can actually be a, a book queen and, you know, <laughs> and, and still shine. So, you know, what do you have to say to them? I want to tell them that they should be very strong, believe in themselves, and then follow their dreams. And they should work very hard and be very humble because through humility, you achieve a lot. So wherever they find themselves, they should remain humble. And with God, they can reach higher heights. Thank you so much. Um, so apparently people are creating fake mm -hmm. accounts with, yes, with your yes, name. Yes, so yes. Let's, let's clarify how to give and how to make sure that you're actually giving okay. um, to the school. So uh, the first disclaimer will be that 
Francisca never has or doesn't have any social media page. Okay. So if you see any social media page out there in the name of Francisca Lamini, it is false, it okay. is fake, okay. don't use it. If you want to reach out to us, you reach out to us by 0566, 056, sorry, 000 231. Okay. Or if you want to make donations to the school, you can do that via our Access Bank account. That's Kita School Pass Students Association. And the account number is 100 in between. Then 72. Okay, give us the phone number again so that we can put it on the so screen. So the phone number is 056 0000231, and that's okay. for Mr. Wasi Yusuf, who is the general secretary of the past student association. Okay, then we would like to uh, put out another short code with a merchant number that's star 718 star 800 hash, and the merchant ID is 056001. So you seek it as school, uh, past students association, and you can make your donations to help us. Uh, and anyway, before we go, I'd like to say a big thank you to the past students of Kettle Secondary School. Um, many of them donated generously towards the course of uh, the NSMQ team yeah. and continue to do so. Um, this year's comp competition, one way or the other, the, the burden has been lessened by from their contribution. If I should start mentioning names here, <laughs> I, will I, will, I will finish. So <laughs> okay. I'll, I'll keep that open. But then I'd like to thank the headmaster, Mr. Gigi Nyo, as well, as well as our uh, president of the of the past students in the person of Mr. Kojo Mata, who is the, 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 the immediate past MD of Apex Bank, as well as some benevolent souls like uh, Mr. Standoge, Mr. Kari Petis Okujeto, who donated, um, and many others, many other many others. great Jolalians, Ben Duchimalo, who, okay. has, who, has, who, has, who is in the UN, and, and many others. And then Ms. Uh, Madame uh, Ayayi uh, of Traffics, Okay. Uh, Bella who, who hosted them to lunch yesterday and some men of CTFM and many other people many who have been who have been donating to uh, this course and and the, and the many that are yet to come and many that are yet you to know, come because we oh, need right. a, a center of science excellence we yeah. need a bus we need an assembly, assembly hall. hall we need laptops exactly. and tablets we, we need admission to Legon to KNUSD admission to MIT and to Yale, Yale. Oh, yes we are praying for you, we're Absolutely. rooting for you. Absolutely. Thank you guys so much. You made us so, so proud. It was such a pleasure to watch you guys. Um, and we forgive you for taking Wesley Girls out. Um, but it's all good. You yeah. know, you guys were fantastic. Yeah. Um, so that's it. Your superstars, people. Keta, Ketasco. Yes. yes, they did the impossible. The great um, Jolali. The great Jolali, yeah. yes. And when I say they did the impossible, I'm purely referring to my school. <laughs> Nothing more. <laughs> um, but here are your superstars. Let's, let's, let's help them out. Let's, let's support the school. And they've, they've really shown that they're made of some really great stuff. All right, we're going to take a quick break. When we come back, um, some more interesting stuff for you. Don't go anywhere. <laughs>